Hello, people. Welcome to the channel, channels, Super Academico and Tapa Olho Azul. And today I'm going to do the pitch for the story Dead of the Darkness. Dead of the Darkness. In Portuguese, Papai das Trevas. Well, for those who, uh, who don't know, the, for those who don't, for those who don't, don't know the channels. Uh, we we bring I bring every week some uh, stories, something interesting in English, so we can spread our presence in the internet, in the YouTube, in both channels, Tapa de Azul and and Super Academic. Mostly, I'm doing pitches for stories because I have many stories written and published that I think that deserve the opportunity to become something more visual, a movie or series. Well, uh, before I begin, don't forget to subscribe to the channels, uh, ring the bell for notifications, take a look at the descriptions to the, see the links for my music, so other contents, and also uh, share the video uh, so someone that you know maybe uh, uh, got the opportunity to put us in the media with these stories. So, the pitch for uh, Dead of the Darkness. It's a, it's a short story that I wrote about uh, a funny thing. I wrote this story was using a, a recording device and not a, a, a written text and I, I recorded that in the recording was transformed into uh, text, written text. Then I just review the text and publish the, the, the short story as a book. So in this story, we have a family, a uh, family draw here, the dad, the mom, and the kids, the son. His name is Dante, Dante, and Dante is supposed to be the Lord of the darkness, the Lord or evil, the son of the devil, something like that. But instead of a, a horror story, I play, I, I developed a, a, a family story where the, the dad, eh, the dad, uh, he is informed by a, a little devil, a little devil, that he's going to be the father of the the, the, <laughs> the darkness boy, the boy of the darkness. And he got this mission uh, and signs a contract with the, the little devil, not for anything, just because the little devil offered him the opportunity to have a son that never gets sick. That's a kind offer. That's an, an offer that uh, any dad should consider yeah, to have a, a child that never gets sick. But in the contract, there is this thing that the, the kid is a powerful being from the darkness. But he signs yeah, a little suspicious, but okay. The son born, the son is born, and he raised the son as a normal child. Uh, the, the, the supernatural, uh, supernatural nature of the child that never gets sick, and he's super intelligent. Uh, he developed very quickly with his language, his uh, uh, intelligence, his keep uh, his capacity to develop developing thoughts that are very mature. But in a way, emotionally, emotionally, he's very. Uh, He's very, how do I say, um, he, is, uh, he likes to express his emotion in a way very, very strong because he is like uh, limitless. Uh, he has no limits because of his power, the power that he has as the son of the darkness. But his father raises him to be a normal child and respect the other. And even when the child is very angry 
and developed like a, a, a girl and red eyes and and becomes to like a, a spread some kind of a smell of sulfur <laughs> of course that's it's a cliche but it's, it's funny and the father learns to to develop him with some kind of uh, empathy because he teach the, the, the kids that is, uh, even with all this power, he have to protect the other. And, and, and that's go against the nature of the son of the darkness, something like that. So in a vacation, uh, in a trip vacation, the family goes to a city and the city uh, they didn't know that it was some kind of a trap and the city was like uh, the city of the, the devil worshippers, something like that. And they were waiting for the kids to get there so they would like transform him into the, the future king of the world, something like that. But in the, the neighbor city, in the next city, there is the opposite. Right? And when they go into visit the, 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 the next city, uh, during the visit, they, they discover that the city uh, is waiting for the like the the, the son of the good, uh, the, the like the new new Christ, the new the new Messiah that to save the world. And they meet the other family. Well, that's funny because uh, they they meet the other family and this, they discover that the the other kid. Is a just normal kid, a normal child that has the same problems, the same things, and and while they, they both see this start to like uh, make riots one against the other, yeah, uh, in favor of one kid or another, the 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 kid of the darkness and the kid of the light, yeah, the kid of the good, whatever, and they make riots and they complain with each other, they fight verbally. Uh, the kids, the family, the families of the kids see that the, the, the fights between the both sides are like a, f a senseless fight, a fight that has no meaning for the kids. Because the kids, they, when they meet, they start just to play. They play like normal kids. You have a kid that's like a destined to be a, a evil child, a evil person, and the other... It's like the savior, the messiah, but they are just kids and they start to play together and become friends. And the family sees that uh, that that uh, that fights between the two groups, that is two cities, actually uh, is is something of that people and not with the children. And the children will just following their lives together actually as friends but the the people who fight like well i intend to be a metaphor of our time where you have like a polarization in the world for things for ideologies and and people that try to represent everybody but they just get divided by opinions that are superficial and in the end, they should be just normal people living and playing together and learning together, just like these two kids. And so, and of course, since the, the center, yeah, the central character in the story is the dead, yeah, the dead of the darkness, the dead that uh, raises the, 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 the sun that's supposed to be the son of the devil something like that. He is the most responsible for that, uh, for that development of the, the child because he just wants his son to be happy, to be, uh, to be able to come uh, live in society with uh, others, even with different ideas and differences of any kind. So that's the story for today. Né? The, the, the story about the dead of the darkness, his son Dante, and the lesson to the world that polarization is an illusion. Right? Everybody, uh, actually, everybody's just 
children that want to play together and not people that want to fight for ideologies that uh, in many cases mean nothing because everybody will just die and cease to exist and it will be very interesting that people just see that and not get and get along without this horrible things that doesn't make any sense so i hope you enjoy share this video and if you know someone that can transform this into a piece of movie or even theater i don't know maybe or a series that reaches more people than just a book that uh, i don't know a dozen people might read someday you know and that's it until the next video and uh, so long goodbye and like subscribe and share the video bye bye